JustAZ.com Productions with JustAZ Hydroponics. Aquaponics Project Update, March 2013. Hi, I'd like to talk to you today about our aquaponics project. It's been five months now, and I'd like to talk to you about our successes as well as some of the issues that we've had along the way. The first thing we did when we started the aquaponics system is to set up the fish barrel. Some of the good points uh, about using this system was the frame that we built for the fish barrel. When I cut the top off the fish barrel, I was worried about how stable it would be. The frame has held it into place, haven't had a problem. Also, the screening on the top has kept leaves and other debris out of the tank. Another idea that was very successful was the overflow here. We had several heavy rains this winter and we've been able to keep the water level down. Uh, we haven't had any overflow, haven't lost any fish. One of the things that didn't work out as well as we thought was the height of this barrel. Because of the height we had to have the grow bed quite a bit higher because of drainage, uh, which posed problems in itself. Another problem we had is the backboard uh, didn't brace it properly and it's kind of sunk. Next is the equipment. The bell siphon and the reap hole work better than we have thought. Not a problem with them. They've been up for over five months, running great. The only problem we had is with the timer for the pump. I originally used an indoor timer and that failed after about a month. I bought an outdoor timer and haven't had a problem with it since. Over the past few months we've grown several types of greens in the bed and we also have snap peas growing up the trellis. I put broccoli in as well but it bolted during the recent heat wave. In the lettuce raft, you see some Swiss chard, and I recently harvested quite a bit of romaine lettuce from the second raft. We haven't added any other nutrients to the bed, and the greens do well due to the high nitrogen content. Over the summer, we'll grow various lettuces and herbs in the bed, and possibly some veggies. We consider our first experiment in aquaponics a success. However, when this growing season is over, we are going to be making some changes. The main one is moving this grow bed from against this wall to here in the front of our pergola to give it more light. We are also going to design a new fish tank which will go underneath and be quite a bit lower than the current barrel. This should keep the heat off the fish and the grow bed should be shading them. We think that will be a lot easier than running plumbing all the way to the barrel in the corner over here. Stay tuned for further updates. Thanks for watching.